What is the maximum cross-sectional area you can fill a pipe if you only have one conductor? The correct answer is 53%. We're going to find this in the Chapter 9, Table 4 tables. Anytime we get to it, we're always going to make sure that we check the type of pipe. In this case, it doesn't matter because it's the same across all these tables. On the left-hand side of this table is our size conduit. If we have more than two wires, if we have a nipple at 60% or any other 60% value, and then if you're only doing one wire, and where this would be practical is like if you're doing a grounding electrode conductor or something like that, but you're only allowed to fill that pipe 53%. To give you the visual, that will let's imagine that this is a piece of pipe and you're looking directly at it. You're allowed to fill that pipe up 53% of that pipe. I am the Electrical Code Coach. You can head to electricalexamcoach.com to learn all about pipe fill. Let's get to it.